Update. Following this update, users are seeing a notification about party safety, and that voice chats and parties may be recorded. Voice chat recording for moderation is a feature that will be available on PS5 when it launches, and will enable users to record their voice chats on PS5 and submit them for moderation review. The pop-up you're seeing on PS4 right now is to let you know that, when you participate in a chat with a PS5 user, post-launch, they may submit those recordings from their PS5 console to Psy. Our latest system software update for PlayStation 4, version 8.00, is launching today globally. This update includes changes to the existing party and messages features, new avatars, updated parental controls and more. Here are some of the key features in this update. Updates to party and messages. Following this update, party and messages will be more tightly linked together, and you will see changes to the UI. Both apps will now use the same groups of players for party voice chats and message exchanges, instead of having different groups set up across the two apps. So now you can start a party chat, or send a message to the group you previously chatted with across PS4, as well as PS5 when it launches. New avatars. We're expanding the collection of preset avatars for players, to showcase on their profile. An array of new avatars from your favorite games will be available, including Bloodborne, Journey, Ghost of Tsushima, God of War, The Last of Us Part II, The Last of Us Remastered Uncharted 4, The Thief's End and many more. Mute all mics from Quick Menu. We've added an option to mute all microphones in the quick menu, so you can easily mute your mix while gaming. Simplified and more flexible parental controls. Under parental controls, we're combining the communicating with other players and viewing content created by other players into one setting, communication and user-generated content to cover both areas of communication and UGC sharing. This offers a simpler setting that's easier for parents to understand and apply to their children. In addition, children can send a request to their parents to use communications features in specific games. When a child sends this request, the parent will receive an email notification and can choose to make an exception for that game and allow the child to use its communications and UGC features. This will provide more flexibility to both parents and children. Enhanced Two-Step Verification The Two-Step Verification (2SV) feature on PS4 will be enhanced to support third-party authenticator apps as an option during the activation flow and 2SV sign-in across PS4, mobile and web. Removal of event creation and private community creation after 8.00, you will no longer be able to create events or access existing events created by other users. We're also removing the ability to create private communities under the community app on PS4. If you already have existing private communities, you can continue to access them. Updates to Remote Play app on mobile and PC VSH 8.00, Remote Play at the same time as 8.00, the existing PS4 Remote Play app on mobile, iOS Android,